Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Card Hunters. Wasn't that an anime? Um, there's Hunter x Hunter and Card like, Captor. Card Captor is the one I'm thinking of. I could have swore there was an anime where there's like people running around smacking cards with sticks and shit happened. That was I never card watched Card Captor. I vaguely recall seeing it on, like on Toonami or something. Way back in the day. Hmm. I've never even looked at it, to be honest. Yeah, I remember seeing it, like, on Toonami. That's about the extent ah. of it. Slub Gut Sanctum. Sure. Ah. Mm. You might want to avoid bringing cards to, that do crushing damage into this next battle. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Lizard men are known to associate with all kinds of puddings, slimes, and jellies. Hey, did you say something about Jello? We don't do that, I'm afraid. Oh, ah, uh, thanks. I guess we'll have to order our green Jello. I mean, lime Jello from somewhere else then. Enough about the awkward nerdities. Hey, it's only awkward if you can't handle the truth. Ah, uh, but you've got some reading to do, good sir. <clears throat> right. Let me just clear my throat. <clears> throat> Hoopla. Hoop, hoop. <laughs> <laughs> Every game shall have a SpongeBob for. <laughs> yeah. All right. Your map leads you deep into the swamp, where you find a long wooden hallway that the lizard men use as f a feasting hall. Approaching with stealth, you pick the lock and enter the stronghold to discover tables covered in rotting meats. Yum. Delicious. Chomping and slavering over the dubious feasts are lizard men netters. Show them no mercy. I'd like to point out that none of us are rogues, yet we are expert at lock picking. I don't I don't pick the lock, I just break the lock. But it says we pick the lock stealthily. I picked it apart. With my fucking hammer. Yeah. <laughs> oh god, it's in between us. Oh boy. As you enter the room a black ooze drops in unannounced, how discombobulating. Alright, well we gotta stack on this guy right away then. Yep. Oh, look at all that stabbing and not all bludgeon damage that you've got, actually. I know. Isn't it lovely? It's absolutely lovely. Fuck that ooze up, homie. No! Oh, it's going to me. <laughs> there oh, are you. <laughs> uh, faith armor. Just go fuck yourself. Evidently, I'm not allowed to do anything spectacular. I see you've gone with some more mobility. Yes, definitely. Thought it was the mobility movement attacks are just lovely. Um, I'm gonna. I am aware I'm entangled in a net. That's why I'm gonna move over here. Oh gosh, they're charging! Fuck that who's up. Uh, simple strike isn't gonna do much, is it? It's not gonna do anything. But that puncture stab. I don't want to waste that range because those netters are coming in. Then use it against a netter. Yeah, yeah, I'll use it against that. Chances are, if I draw an attack, I'll definitely more than likely be either magic attack or. Oh. Yeah, I'm aware I'm netted. Oh. Well, now you're netted too. May as well just pass. Or you can run. Nope. Going right for him. No, I'll pass to you. You can use your ability. Oh god. No, stop it. Go for him, not me. Limited heal, what's that? It's a four heal. All you, bud. Oh, Jesus. That slime hit me for fucking five after I healed for four. Oh, it hurts. You know, in retrospect, I probably should have righteous frenzied you the first yeah. thing, but oh well. Instead of just running a circle around me? Well, like before you started attacking, but you know. Oh, for God's sakes, two missile blocks. Ooh, a weak chop. Yeah. Fuck you! Oh, I gotta use it on myself. <sighs> Shit. Yeah, I'm I'm doing fine so far. You can. I've been crunched. Ah. 
All right. Using her on myself, because I'm gonna kill that fucking ooze. Go for it. Die, ooze. All right, well that's one big problem out of the way. Yep, now we just have three more. Like, I love that Unholy Frenzy, but I also dislike the fact that every time that I that I get, like, someone attacks me, I lose it occasion or, like, I have the potential to lose it. I should say. Yeah. You wanna stab that one that's at one HP? Or do you yeah. want... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Get rid of it. Before he gets away. Ha! <laughs> Take that. Victory. Oh, goody. Guess what? I also have a move. <laughs> Punch. Good luck getting far. It's it's kind of interesting when you decided to drop your your movement against a lizardman, because missile block and mail are too useful to let go otherwise. Yeah, like uh, I'll find much more opportunity to keep that around. Yeah. Um, I'll hit him one at a time here. Oh, uh, I'll kill him. Oh. Aha. Um, yay, health. Love the, the, uh, the sapping spear. So nice. It's a ranged attack and it heals me. How's it going? Ah, I figured he'd do that. Don't worry. I definitely can hit him. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, I figured out what le why Leather Harness is so nice. It works for all of my armor. Mm-hmm. Aww. That's a beautiful thing. Aww. For those that missed it, Leather Harness will add one to his roll. Yes. For all armor. Whenever you roll a die for armor, it adds one to it. So every single armor piece that I have that I roll for, it just gives me plus one. Which is amazing. I was sitting here like, oh, dude, it's five plus for one armor. That's not that awesome. And then I didn't know, but it affected all of mine. Oh, oh, oh I got my good stab. I got, and he's cursed. He's dead. It's done. It's Dunsky. Boom. Mmm. Yeah. Papa Manchu's pizza is pretty good, Mordo. But. Make sure you always get the soy sauce on the side. Soy sauce on pizza. Interesting. Well, he, if you, in case you didn't know earlier on, he was like, can we get the pizza with extra tofu or whatever? Oh, that's right. He got a tofu pizza. Yeah, that makes sense then. All right. You got some reading. Right. The room contains a chest in the lizard men's possessions. Also a great deal of spoiled meat. Well, once again. At the rear of the hall, you find a pathway leading east, deeper into the swamp, towards another wooden hall with light visible from the inside. You must be close to Slubgut now. Fucking hope so. <laughs> There's no doorbell here, so you're forced to break down Slubgut's door. That's sure to annoy him. <laughs> I'll let you treasure. I'll read this one. Kicking in the door, you surprise Slubgut, the one-time scourge of the southern swamps. In this room, there is a dais with a statue of a reptile. Slubgut genuflex urgently in front of the statue. Why is every time I read, there's fucking words I don't know? I just make it look easy. I know. Here, let me look. Genuflex? 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 Genuflex. Genuflex. Whatever. Tough lizard men darters stand between you and their master, the firelight glinting wickedly on their sharp spear tips. Always with the spears. You were close. You were really close. 
I don't even know what the word means, to be honest with you. I literally don't know the meaning of the word. <laughs> Slay them. Now we're fighting Naga, apparently. Oh. Uh, can you go for the di- Well, mm, uh, uh, What? what uh, are those noises? What are those noises? I'm trying to decide what the best, like, where you can move that I can actually hit you with Unholy Frenzy. Well, I would like to move right in the middle of those four pillars. Um, Actually, no, that'd be a bad idea, I think. No, not that bad of an idea, because I'll be right behind you. Well, we can funnel them, so actually I'd rather move uh, two spaces in front of you. Two spaces in front of me? Yes. I'm sure you know which one's me. Or in front of myself. Okay, I can hit you with, with misguided, or not misguided heal, but on unholy frenzy from there, so that'd be... Not a bad idea. Okay. Hopefully they come to me. Well, if they don't... You have two turns. Oh, goody. Reach swing for eight. Crunch. Damn. It's only slightly ridiculous. Try fleeing now, bitch. Oh, they're separate, goody. They don't move together. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna kill Sorry. this. That one's dead. Yeah, we'll get rid of his flunkies first. Ah, oh, he's coming for me. Step one. Four damage, damn. Uh, looks like I'm gonna be misguiding healing you here in a second. Hard to block. Oh god. Is that gonna kill you? Oh, it went for you. Oh, it went for what? Alright, whatever. Here, uh, be healed misguidedly. Two more HP is better than no more HP. <laughs> On attacks. Ooh, goody. What is this? My trait. Fuck him up, you still have that unholy frenzy on him. On ya. New puncture stab. Ha! Better run. Uh, me, me, I can kill him. Yeah. Penetrating cuts. All we've got now is little dick. Oh, bastard. Well. Oop. That was rough. That was, that was a poor decision. Yeah, I didn't expect him to have a little wizard guy to have such a high hitting ability. Try to make him come to you, so you should have moved two spaces away. That way he's got to come at least within one to get to you. And you'll waste a turn doing that. I suppose it's true. He doesn't need to have any range on his spells, unfortunately. All his spells do is curse you for nothing. As far as I've seen, he's had no range that can amply damage you. Just gonna, mm. just gonna pass and sit there and make him come to you, or? Well, I'd actually end round because he passed first. Did he? Yeah. Opponent always goes first in this. I have no idea why, but they do. Like, does it say pass or does it say end yeah, round? Yeah, as, as soon as the round starts, it'll. No, say I'm saying on your character. Pass. Does it say pass? No, it says end round. Oh, okay. Wow. Well, you got really no other choice but to try to go after him. Yeah, I know. Haha, take that. I'll block your bad luck and then stab you in the face. Haha, take that. If only you could have blocked. Aha! Every turn you move is a turn I have to wail on you. Jesus. I will admit, he is one mobile motherfucker. Yeah. That was three movements? Yeah. That's crazy. Oh crap, yeah. ill fit armor. That's not good. I mean, it's not bad. It definitely encumbers you, which is not good in this particular case. Oh, you fucker. Yeah, but it's also 
good for other yeah. things. Saying it's bad, I'm just saying for this particular case, yeah. it's not good. Oh. Hmm. I drop the old fit. I'll throw it. Uh, yeah. I'd keep the. Mmm. Mm. Get rid of the missile block. His missiles don't actually hurt, they just keep cursing me, and I'm already fucking cursed, so why does that matter? Oh, get within range. I'll pass, I'll see what he does. Oh, that's what he did. Hopefully he moves again. No, he ended the fucking round, are you kidding me? Rough. That's fine. Keep the swing. And the move. Aw. Oh. No. I would have kept the move in the swing, personally. I need the mail. I'm gonna need luck, because he's not gonna just walk away. Or, he's not gonna go without damaging me a little. Pen staff. And he's dead. Yep. Perfect. Boom. Shaka laka. Free. Victory! Yeah! With Slough God and his bodyguard slain, you are free to plunder his ill gotten treasures. You find a chest hidden under a pile of furs and skins. Now that Slubgut is defeated, the Lizardmen threat will fade. Without their charismatic and bellicose leader, they retreat to the swamps, returning to a peaceful existence. One would hope. I sure have slain quite a few Lizardmen in my day. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, D&D &D reference. Oh, you hush now. <laughs> Ooh, an epic. I got an epic. Oh my god, you just reminded me of a fucking video from on YouTube. I got uh, Cractopus oil worth 200 gold. Silver ingots that sell for 2 gold, excuse me? Bars of silver, 2 gold. A small emerald, 10 gold. <laughs> I don't have a shield yet, but my character model has one. Excuse me? Rare divine item. Oh my. Oh, it's so worth potentially get taking this. It's a trait and it's rough. There's a downside to the trait, but it's got some it's got two powerful abilities. Okay. The the, the down the, the trait is uh you take for unpreventable holy damage. So when I draw the revenge, I have to use it and I take four damage. The other abilities on it, however, are Armor of Faith and Mass Frenzy. Every ally, including you, gains Frenzy 2 duration 2. Wow, that's, that's pretty good. I don't know, that downside though. I know. Uh, yeah, maybe later. There's also boots. Wait. Aw, why are all the boots like decent but not amazing? Woohoo! Yeah. A laser? What? There's a laser at the shop? What? A laser in the shop. Yeah, you want to run that by me one more time? <laughs> There's a laser in the shop. But shop, or oh, I suppose it's different for everybody. The daily deal. Forty. Uh, yeah. Let me just, let me just uh, saunter down to the, the deals of the dales. Dude, I could get those warp rods. Super right now. cooled laser. All right. Minor erratic damage. Seven damage. Add two damage to any cold attack you play. Keep. Jesus. It's a fucking staff. That laser gun. Yeah, apparently. Oh my. 
Martyr's Pick. Rare Divine Weapon. Sea Overswing. Sea Overswing. Reach Swing. Simple Strike. Fragile Curse. Fragile Curse. Uh oh. That's fucking bananas. It's only a hundred for it, too. I have no money, though. I'm spending money on gear as it becomes a bit unnecessary. It's really unfortunate. Oh well. What are you, the House of Artifacts? Way the fuck over here. This gives us stuff from the expansion that we can buy. Uh, why not? I'll buy one chest. See what I get. Apparently I got a powerful item that requires- Oh my, I don't even have that kind of power tokens. Opaline Hammer, level 15, not usable by this class. Pressing Bash, 6 damage. Slide back 1, then move- then you move 1. Pressing Bash, Bash, slide back 1, 5 damage. Add 2 damage to any other Bash you play, keep. Simple Bash, 4 damage, 1 range. Parry, block melee, draw a card on a two or higher. Jesus, that's a fucking nice hammer. Alright, are you ready for the next dungeon? The rescue from Shieldhaven Prison? Yes. Sure. Because after that, it's Diamonds of the Kobolds, right? Uh, yes. Okay, I wanted to make sure. Let's go rescue some bitches. Lol. Dude, just be yourself. Express that you're playing D&D to a lady. She might appreciate it. Did you click it? Because it's not giving me the option to come with you. There you go. Oh, my bad. Follow! Pizza! Hi, I'm Karen. I'll be your delivery person for this evening. Wow! Papa Manchu Pizza, always fresh and hot. Hey, what's that you're playing? Mm. Oh, we're not playing. We're uh, studying medieval justice systems for our um, history test. Thanks for the pizza. Or where was I? Oh yes, Baron Daughter Prison Rescue. To arms, adventurers! Right. Four exciting battles in this pack. Oh Jesus! Shield Haven Prison is well nigh inescapable, but Baron Morton has hired you to do the impossible. Your mission: break in, battle past hardened guards and rescue the Baron's wrongfully imprisoned daughter. The rewards are great, but so is the danger. Prepare yourself! My body is ready. Alright, and our story begins by bribing a groundskeeper. You gain entry to the prison via conveniently unguarded drain cover. Once inside, you set forth to rescue Baron Morton's daughter, Griselda, from this dank nightmare. Your first obstacle will be a guard lecturing some obnoxious servants. Well, let's clearly murder the servants, because they are definitely the, the bigger threat here. They probably won't even pop up. There's three servants. Oh, look at that, servants. <laughs> Nob the laundry boy shrieks in panic, bringing your intrusion to the attention of two skilled men-at-arms. You're going to need to deal with these guards before they can raise the alarm. Oh, goody. Is he called Nob, really? Let's find out, shall we? Arl, Gus. Sprat, Gus, Bjorn, Nob. How the fuck did Nob know we were here? Nob took off. Nob's gone. Alright, well, we clearly need, in case you didn't notice, the victory squares. Yeah. So we need to kind of make a mad dash for the end here. Wow. Literally, mad dash. But the servant's in the way! Oh, goody. Everybody else draws guard except us. Yeah. Ah, that was a very, very girly noise. Um, I should have had you curse him first. Probably would have been, probably for the better. Sprinting like a madman. Don't worry, I'll curse the, uh, uh, not this round, but next round. I'll curse the guard. I'd do it this round. Because I'm 
none of us have attacks, and it only lasts one turn. Not D&D. &D. It's Card Hunter. Kind of. By kind of recording, I mean definitely recording. Now that's a card worth using! Because my fucking trait's amazing. Here. Be frenzily- frenzied. <laughs> I, I've never seen that before. Target may act again this round? Well, feel free to try and act, but I'm pretty sure he's Dunsky, so I'm gonna pass. Yeah. And as soon as we end this turn, you'll get healed for three, and then I can potentially curse this motherfucker, and that way you can potentially murder him. Boy, that'd be nice. Mod 6 damage attack. You did not draw- How are we even gonna get over there? Uh, I don't think I have the movement. I do. Probably. Um, you can deal... I'll pass to you. I curse the shit out of him. You better run. I can s Mm, yeah, I'll sap spear him. Excuse me? No! Excuse me? Excuse me? Oh. You go after- I was gonna say, I wouldn't have wasted it. That would have been 8 damage. You run run, 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 run. <laughs> Your shit needs to get up there quicker. Oh, I'll get up there quicker, don't worry. I'll close the distance. I am going for speed, after all. Ooh. Well, I can't do anything from this point. Seriously? Yeah, I, line of sight's broken. Oh. Oh boy. I'm sure we'll be fine. Ooh, two movements. Look at all them reaching swings I've got. <laughs> oh, you bastards. Like playing Chinese checkers. How dare you assault me! You'll pay for that! Jesus. Stop raising alarms, you stupid servants. Well, uh, this is gonna hurt, but, uh... Damn. Kinda brutal on your part. Well, this is unfortunate. I'm gonna have to drop a reach swing and a fucking simple strike. Personally, even if, even if the weak strike did more damage. Excuse me? All right. Even if the weak strike did more damage, keep the chop in this case, because they're just going to be cluster fucked down there. Mm-hmm. And... Yeah, I'll get rid of the block. <laughs> I guess I can't. No, uh, playing right now. Oh. <laughs> There you go. Now you can get rid of the block. We got three more rounds to get down there and contest that. Mmm, baby. Bam. Nice. That leather harness. Unfortunate. I have to heal. Oh boy. I can't kill him in one unless I get rid of my reach move. Which I don't want to do. Do it, dude. They're not gonna be able to go anywhere. They're they're guards. Oh, 
I see. Yeah. <laughs> and we needed two points. With the guards defeated, you can now venture further inside the prison. A trapdoor at the end of the corridor is the only way forward. Loud noises can be heard beyond. Voices. From beyond. Oh. Voices. I see. <laughs> Perhaps Karen is chained to her pizza delivery job, just like the Baron's daughter is chained to this jail. That doesn't seem right. Two whole gold ingots worth two gold. I know, right? I can melt that down for more gold. <laughs> it's horseshit. It's horseshit. horseshit. I know. Such horseshit. Well, literary master. Oh, right. I was busy looking. Um, the prison is guarded by a brutish company of men-at-arms who dedicate their lives to administering summary justice to their guards. Yes. During their time off duty, they reside here in the guardhouse to play cards and drink rum. What a great job. Sounds like Devin. <laughs> but the real danger here is the guard dogs. These cowardly beasts are capable of quickly taking down the most capable warrior if they are allowed to attack from behind. AKA, fuck them up first, because the men at arms weren't all that tough. Mm, not really. Oh boy. Be aware, Mordo, it's not necessary to kill the servants to win. Are you chaotic or lawful? Ah, uh, kind of chaotic, or like chaotic, chaotic, good. No, wait. Awful chaotic. I don't know. I don't remember how the fuck. No, it no, no. It'd be chaotic good. Chaotic good. Awful good or lawful evil. Well, uh, I'm a priest, but I do have unholy and life sapping abilities. So, fuck it. The I don't know. The servants. I don't think they give any stars either. No, they don't. So they did it in the last one. They do so stuff. Should we, uh, should we corner rape the dogs here? Oh yeah, Rex, Rex and Fido, totally. Do what we can to Rex and Fido. Just card all attack. Wow, that's nice. Yeah, totally. Totally, uh, corner rape the puppy dogs. What are you gonna do? I feel you... like this is a trap for some reason. Because I, 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 they can't. Like we should have gone for the guard. That's <laughs> because that that would be the hard one. Yeah, I guess. Well, I just, I just don't know what to do. Oh. To. Skillful dodge! Are you shitting me? Didn't work too well in his favor, did it? No, it didn't. <laughs> Run, Help puppy! Face. Run! Your master calls! How's that for skillful dodging? Mm -hmm. Remove, scamper. Wow, that's got some range. Well, not far enough. I'm trying to go behind you. Let him try. Mm, then I'm done here. Done enough. Wow. Pass to me, please. <laughs> Fuck up the men at arms. <laughs> the servants are all like, I don't know what to do. Love healing people to death. It's so much fun. Please don't move, dog. Dog's gonna move. Not far enough. I can kill him. Yay! 
Backbiting strike. My back! Onward to victory! With the guards taken care of, you can now proceed into the prison in search of Griselda. Frenzy barking can be heard from up ahead. More of these accursed canines must be dealt with, and quickly. That's fine. They're not that tough. I have a feeling we just maneuvered that well. A crusty helm. So, I just got a trait from a novice gouging common martial skill. That, and, uh, obviously not usable in my class because it's martial, not divine skill. But, uh, it's a trait, and it says, Attach this card to yourself, duration 3. Just add 1 damage to any penetrating melee attack you play. Keep, and then it also comes with two penetrating cuts. Whoa. Where do these blue Manchu designers get their ideas? I would, could never come up with this sort of material. <sighs> okay. The dog yard is home to a pack of three starving guard dogs who have been trained to attack strangers on sight. They are tended to by a feral urchin, and though incapable of speech, he has the audacity to accost you. Make this cur and his charges share the same fate. Okay. Sounds fair. We can so like we can dealing with Igor here or Dog Boy. I rolled a twelve, so you attempt to calm the dog fails. Possibly you should have put more points into animal husbandry. That's not how things work. I mean it can be. No, especially not in fifth edition. Run for the one on the far corner, quickly, the right corner. So, that one there? The Rex? Because there's Rex, Rex. Spot, yeah, and Fido. Rex. Okay. Wow. Your ill fitting armor. How fitting that it's keeping you from doing anything. I don't think I'll have to worry about it. But, you know, may as well just. Call it a hunch. It's a good hunch. Nice. Beautiful. Bonus health. Ooh, bonus health. Fuck you, puppy. That was a beautiful draw. For me? No, for me. My altruism into a reach swing. Seven damage. Jeez. That's for these dogs are not so cowardly. No, these ones are a little bit tougher. No, you're not A getting away and B outmaneuvering me. Just put your back to me. What the fuck do you think you're doing? I hold firm. Be gone, ill fitting armor. Never fit me for all that what right anyway. Perfect. Oak. I like this quest. This is fun. Yeah, this one's easy. I like it. Yeah. It's not punishing in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> and this is a higher level than the last one. Yeah. Don't worry, the last fucking battle's left here. Yeah, it's probably like 10 dogs or something. 20 fucking dogs. Crossing the dog yard brings you to the entrance of the dread prison catacombs, where the majority of the prisoners are held. Griselda is surely inside. Probably not. I don't know, I feel like this one's gonna have a twist. Thin point guard. Lunging stab, lunging stab, shifty stab, shifty stab. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh. Round this card to all enemy cards. Handicaps attached to adjacent. Heal 
Wow! Yeah, on the off chance that I can actually use that, I'm gonna fucking take that and use that. If you are free the Baron's daughter, perhaps she and Erwin might like to hang out sometime. Probably unlikely. Chicks, lesbian, hot. Hey, my elf is a dude. Oh, is it hard to tell? My bad. Anyway, no one has escaped the prison in 20 years. Imagine Warden Gorald's surprise to find that someone has broken in. He will seek retribution for this outrage. He has a small retinue of servants and a fanatically loyal hound named Scar. Scar wears a bespoke chainmail suit, making him even tougher to harm than the dogs you have faced thus far. You hear Griselda's faint cries for help from nearby. For the House Morton, to battle! And victory! Wow, we got a bed in this place. <laughs> Damn. The dog gets the bed, that's hilarious. Warden, Warden, that's them, screams the sniveling servant. Stand back, knob. Scar and I will punish these criminals, commands the brutish master of the jail. Holy presence, what do you know? I, Just what I wanted. So if you take any DOT effects, any abilities, as long as you're near me, or any handicaps on you at all, they'll be cleansed and healed. You'll be healed for one point. So that's Nob right there. We found Nob. Found Nob. Little bastard was running. Um, I can kill him if you want me to. And actually, we have to. From no, oh, unless one of these guys gets mm -hmm. two. I yeah, think. I think. These guys might be two. Pass it to me. I want to make sure he dies, just so he can't do anything. This is the one okay. case in which I feel killing the servant is a good decision. It's a shame. <laughs> it's, it uh, had to be done. Yep. That's what he gets for trying to 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 inform everybody of our. Oh hi. How's it going? Um. I'm gonna join the fray. What a douche. That's what you get for joining the fray. Oh, you fucker! That's what you get for attempting to do stuff in the fray. Shut up. Still got my weak strike. <laughs> yeah, you know what the funny thing is, though? What? Those aren't keeps. That's why I use my weaker strike first. I took one for the team. Hi Rex, Scar, you killed Mufasa, time to die. Healer. Oh, what do you know? That's the thing I was talking about. Damn. Um, I've got two reach swings to use with it too. Wow. So, yeah, he's probably gonna have like six more somewhere in his deck. I'm dead, by the way. So, uh, yeah, you're on your own. Just me and the dog. You and Scar, man. D Avenge Mufasa. Gotta be the Simba here. Puncturing stab. That is actually penetrating. But it also breaks his armor. Yep. The dog's picture looks kind of like a bug. And say if he doesn't kill you here, you win. Yeah, it was an easy punch fest. It was. I'll admit. Monsters slain, prisoners rescued, treasure looted, few. Let's crack open a celebratory bottle of soda. Party hard. Party hard. The defeated warden, Gerald, has a set of keys on his belt which opens the cells throughout the prison. 
You discover Griselda in a cell nearby, unmolested but bedraggled. She is overcome with relief at her rescue and promises great rewards upon your safe return to her father. Rewards you truly earned. Booyah, level up. I know, I actually can finally equip a shield. I can equip a helmet. And I think we all agree, I need a helmet sometimes. Well, considering your character's had a helmet since level 5. My it's character's enough. had a shield since level 5. <laughs> but not had a shield. Brain burn. The downside. Yeah, I got a. It's a nice staff and it's got good stuff, but brain burn scares me. <laughs> well, it's a good thing you're not a mage. That's true. I do have one, though. Well, of course. That being said, it is time for this episode to come to an end. Wah, wah. Yes, unfortunately. So thank you all for watching, and we will see you in the next video. See ya.